Hello everyone, welcome back to Know It Today and in this video we will see how we can add someone as a collaborator. So I'll log in. So for inviting someone as collaborator, if I am a store owner, so I'll have to go to users. When users opens, we have to go to security. Under security, like this is the code we required and yeah, simple. So what now how the person will use this code so for collaborator you need to be a partner and you need to log in so i'll log in from my account so we are in now what i need to do is i need to add a store and i'll so from partners right this is partners dashboard so come here and uh, you need to add a store and you need to request access to a store so i'll ask for the access to the store now our store is powers.in but this is not its shopify url right so if we go to uh, its domain we need to give the my shopify url mm. So this is our my Shopify URL but and we'll put it here. So we need to provide the collaborator code. So as we saw from here we go to users we go to security and this is a collaborator code that we use and yeah. Now we have the collaborator code we'll select all but you can nitpick the permissions you need these are the permission you are uh, requesting from the store owner they can review it and they can provide you any specific type of permission but this way you request access to a store so this video is for both the store owner and for the developer for the collaborator now the access is pending now we should get some access here uh, maybe i'll get a notification uh, okay here i am i got this access notification now i come to here uh, i am getting the request and i can accept the request or i can assign a role so online store editor this is the simple way uh, which this is the most common permission that you can give okay but uh, in this project i am like in this store i am handling a lot of things so i'll accept request and uh, now it was pending i'll reload it it is active so now i should get access to this store okay now so if i see the stores i have access to i see the thoughts store i have now i'll log in from here so here i log in using this admin okay so now i have access to torch okay great so this is how you uh, get access to stores please like this video if it helped you and subscribe to my channel for more such contents on shopify and other open source softwares thanks for watching see you in the next one